You hear a rather out of the ordinary sound. You decide to go take a look. You are unimpressed of the awakening of your sleep. It has been a dreadful night. Winds towering above normal. The storm had gotten better of the once known Malugar ship. The boat hit an iceberg, leaving a daunting hole in the side. However, luckily, you have run aground on a rather small island of the coast of Jalpo. Rumors have it that the island is cursed. Danger is abound, and you are by no means safe. It's up to you, traveler, to get yourself off the island and reach Malhar Harbor. There you will find the only way to recover your freedom. The island has been around for many years and is said to be abandoned. Do not let this fool you. You are by no means alone. You must get off this island, Jalpo. Will you survive? Can the island get the better of you? You and only you can unroll this mystery of a profound darkness. Good luck. Alright guys, welcome to another adventure map. Today we are playing the cursed island of Jalpo. Now what actually happens is that when you spawn, there seems to be this problem when you spawn under the ship. Um, and you spawn with all these, like, these items, uh, they've gone now, but you spawn with all these items, and you have to, you, you have to get rid of them and you break into the ship. He actually says to do that on the, um, on the, like, the forum information for the map. And, you know, you're meant to spawn up there and you come down here. You appear to be the captain of the ship. Now we're gonna head up. Now, the map is by the carpenter, I believe, and the map pack, and the, the map pack, the texture pack that I am using is the Arcane Texture Pack by Sumpompolis is his name, it's a really odd name. Anyway, your objective, reach the Malhar Harbor. Collect as many diamonds as possible. And there goes my phone, as always, right on cue. The rules must read. The rules must read. There be sharks in the water, swimming is not allowed. Only destroy clay box or when you are promoted to. No detouring off the adventure. No crafting items unless towed to. Stick to the cobblestone road. You will see. Play it on normal or hard, not easy or peaceful. Now, unfortunately, that was like the third time I had to redo that beginning because you know once I started it out here but then I didn't realize and I went back to read the forms and I found out next time I started it down here instead of in the bedroom and I you know and then I did the third time then and unfortunately because of all that it's not now night so what I'm gonna do you will find you find yourself landing in some landing island to be somewhat illuminated and blue ducks you know black sheep now, I'm just going to, I want to sleep, and then I'm going to set it to hard, because, you know, uh, I don't have any equipment or anything, and I don't want to start playing on hard without, you know, any equipment or accessories. Take a book and remove a loose page. The island be cursed, man. Don't you trust nobody. Lucky for me, man, I keep my treasures below my hut. Keep it safe and sound. Nobody going to touch it. You gather that it's the man's diary and decide to explore. Ooh, clay, I believe. Down we go. You find a page from his diary. P chapter 5, page 4. It take me and my fellow friends to the lighthouse. Oh, wait. D what? You find... So, does, is this... Oh, hang on. I'll try to make sense of this. The waters be dangerous, man, and fucks with wild the sharks. The only way to get to the port of Jalpul Island, man, it, uh, to the port on Jalpul Island, man, is craft yourself some boats. We have plenty of resources on the island. I take me and my fellow friends to the lighthouse. Um, that's like in the wrong order. But let's see, we got some clay. Nothing on the crafting table. No chests or anything. Nope. Hmm. hmm. Let's see. Yeah, it's around here. No, nothing. Nothing around here. 
No clay or anything on the side here. Whoop, not let it swim, not let it swim. Ooh, I got out in time. Just I got out before the sharks could get me. Don't worry. Don't worry, I'm good. Ooh, getting a bit framey. Let's have a look. Oh, it appears. Oh, wait. There's torches around here. Is there clay somewhere here? Or is it just the entire thing lit up so no monsters spawn? I guess that's probably it. It looks like I didn't even need to sleep. But I have to get over to there with a the boat. I'm probably really blind and miss something, knowing me. No, let's have a look. Hmm, we're not allowed to destroy anything but clay. So where do I get my wood from? Whoop. Whoops. Oh, well, I didn't do anything bad there. Hmm. It's a painting. Let's see. No clay. What to do? What to do? Alright, guys. As always, what I'm going to do is when I find the answer, I'm just going to cut to it. See you guys in a second. Okay guys, I'm back, and it appears that I wasn't reading this quite right, and I've had a look, you know, I, it, it's actually taken me a while, it's supposed to be about 20 minutes, and you know, I was getting a bit frustrated, so I just had a look at some YouTube videos, and um, they all seem to either just swim across the water, or craft their own, so, craft their own boats, and it appears that's what, on closer inspection, inspection, inspection that's what the words actually mean, so I'm just gonna quickly chop up some wood and get some boats. This is me getting my amazing achievement. Do, 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 do. You know, I I hate chopping up wood in videos because it's just you can't. What do you say when you're cutting up the wood? What do you talk about? I'm cutting up the wood. You know. And I also, you may notice I destroyed this bookcase. The reason I destroyed it is just in case um, I wanted to see if it was a chest, just in case I um, wasn't quite aware of what chests look like, because this is the first time I've ever used this texture pack. So I was just double checking it wasn't a chest. I'm going to keep them. We're not allowed to craft anymore, so. I'm obviously not allowed to use it, but seeing as it's what other people did, I thought I'd just do it as well. Alright, let's get going. Come on, get off the wall, get off the wall, get off the wall, get off the wall. There we go. It's, it's a little raft. Look at it. Look at it go. It's quite a beautiful texture pack. And have a look at that moon. Alright. Oh, look, we're already here. Welcome to Port Paul Tulman. Hmm. Oh, that's what this is where the cobblestone goes. We'll go in here first. Delta Lighthouse. A couple of chairs and a ladder going up. Seems quite impractical. And quite unsafe for a lighthouse to have a ladder instead of stairs. Oh, the, now I know what chests look like, thank God. Some roar fish. Some wooden swords. A lever. I'm gonna get rid of them. And some cooked pork chops. I'm gonna get rid of the boat and the clay. Oh, the wooden sword looks like a staff, which is awesome. Where do we go next? That seems to be the town. It's up here. Let's see. The Dungeon of Agility. Nope, we can't get in there yet. And it seems we may have to use the lever, I'm guessing, but we haven't been told to, so I'm not going to. 
Village Tarl Jamir. Such a such such craft goes into making these map packs. M M Mr. Hamtan. No, nothing but a bed. I'm, just, I'm actually gonna sleep. I can hear a zombie, so I'm gonna sleep. I want to avoid getting like too many creepers or anything. And it blowing up half the map. Oh, you can't find me. Hiya. Hiya. Village disposal. Oh, oh god. Oh god, oh god. Oh. My bad, guys. Well, that was unfortunate. And it seems to have saved there like a checkpoint. Maybe that's a new that that came with one of the new updates. But now I have no swords or anything. Miss Malapasso's Palace place. The last sighting of Malapasso was two days back. Concerns are uprising in the village. Nope. I like how, how these villages are meant to, Maybe they were not meant to be. Do not drink the water. Village... Oh, already been in there. Don't want to go in there again. The village is strangely deserted. Of course it is. It always is. Mr. and Mrs. Johnston's. Oh, trap door up the back. And a ladder going up. These guys were well off. You struggle to handle the rotten smell of dead flesh. Whatever cap and diamond. <laughs> I'm going to completely ignore the fact that there's a ton of bones in there. Because, you know, I'm a sick bastard. Now, there's a path going down there, but I want to continue exploring the rest of the village. Marriott's Mansion. To any visitor to this town, beware. Our town is cursed. People have been dying ghastly deaths. We think there may be something in the water. Voices slowly changing as I talk. After we bury them, three days later, they rise from their deaths, and I realize it's just a girl, and come back to life, and attack the living. They crave our flesh. We've had to build walls around the village. However, we lose villages daily. It's not looking good. Last note, I'm the only one left. They are everywhere. Oh no, they are breaking in the door. Help me. <laughs> Some clay here. Two diamond. Stick that up there. Luckily, I didn't have any diamond. Just a bed. And it's getting dark again. It always gets dark so quickly. Where else do we have to go?